Yo yeah, guys, it's your boy Stray J Dad here. Welcome back to episode two, season one of the Central Coast Mariners U Squad Legends RTG Rebuild. <laughs> it's a long name, but anyway, today or the same day as the first episode, we're going to be checking February's scout reports, checking the league table. Mm, I'm not I'm looking at the league table right now. We are not doing. I mean, we're doing better than we are in real life with only five points. But, we are checking today's U Squad report and the rest of the season. So let's have a look right now. So right here we're going to go into the month of... Oh wait, it's just... There's nothing here, is there? I mean, I'll, I'll bring you back to when it's back on, okay? Okay, we are back. Training injury. Asperado must have five months. Oh, let's see how I send it back. Quickly, we just got to have a check at the squadly monthly report. We still can't bring any of these guys in, but Morgan Edwards is looking very promising and we'll hopefully bring him in soon with a 75 to 89 potential with a 56 overall. With Minja Suk with a 79 to 94, still looking like he will be the world class player out of the Morgan and himself. Next, we'll go into the Brazil, oh no, the Korean one, with no players to really report that are going to be joining the club this February. Let's have a look in the Cameroonian country, and no one else. There's only all. Oh, Saidu Mabraga with an 83 to 94 potential with a 59 to 79 overall with a $1 million value. Brilliant. I just fired him. We'll sign him up. And in Australia, it's absolute dog shit as it is. Yeah, I know. So we're going to go into the office. We're going to go and he's a left midfielder. Just what we need. Good agility and what else has he got good ball control and good curve so he will promote to the senior team and he's been accepted so we will go to the edit player and we will dress him up like a good football player we will give him the adidas adidas what should i give him Oh no, Nike, we'll go to Nike this time. We'll give him the Hyper Venom Phantoms again. Tuck, what have you got? Oh, he's got. No, I'm gonna give him high socks because I want him looking sharp. That's him. And then, then, and then I'll see you guys next month. Okay, we're back. As we're going through our emails, a lot of injuries I see and a lot of suspensions, which is not very good. Let's just quickly check the youth squad in the month report and still no one to bring in Morgan Edwards, hmm, my friend. He will be leaving the club because he's not very promising anymore. Now let's go into South Korea with no one very good to bring in yet. Now we'll go to Cameroon. As you can see by the four players, it has like overall, 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 overall. There's no one really good to bring in by looking at that. And then you check the value that's up here, which the camera would focus. If the camera would focus. Bang. There we go. Right up there. He's not very good value, but because we need players, I will bring him in. And the camera's just gone unfocused again. And it's back. Both trash. No one good there. How are we going in the league with three games to go? We're in seventh. With a final contention... It's still like Wellington Phoenix. What the absolute heck are they doing on top of the la the, the, la the league? 
with three games to go. So we play the Wanderers, Adelaide, and Melbourne City this month. And they're all above us. So, um... We will play, play Wanderers, Adelaide, and City. Yeah, they're all above us. So, um, good, good, quick month for the last month. So, um, we'll see you guys next month then. Eh? Hopefully, we make finals. So, as you can see here, at the end of the season, we lost to Melbourne City. Beat Adelaide 2-1 and drew to the Wanderers. So that means we are through to the finals. And we play Sydney. So I will be we will be watching that game. Training injury. Is that Flurry? Oh, no. Not Banzow. So let's just quickly have a look at the new squad. The Mountain Dew Report. And we can bring them both in. Ooh. I'll bring them both in because that's the aim of the game. Let's have a look at the squad in monthly reports. Still no one yet in Korea for a while. So we've had no one from Korea, I don't think, yet this season. But Cameroon is where we bring up good players. And I'm happy with Cameroon. I'm going to scout them again next season or another African country to hopefully... Uh, I'm going to have to scout Australia because it is an Australian team. But we will be watching this game. So, let's just have a look at the team right now. Asperotomus out. Not very happy with him right now. Mbraga. He can play... Oh, yeah. Still 55 overall. Nothing special. Oh, these guys can both play centre-back and right-back. Looks like Miller will be chilling there for the end of the season. Anyway, we still don't have a striker or a goal key. We do, but we he's in the youth academy. So we will go to the next game after we've up after we've added all players. So we'll be right back after we've done this. Okay, I've done that now. Now let's sim to the Sydney FC game and hope we can beat them in the elimination finals, as it says. Ratio, ha. Huh. Here we go, here we go, right here. If we do make it to the final, that will be the next episode I will play that game. Here we go. Simming match. Oh, let's go. Three. Two. One. Now. Hopefully we can win, because I really hope we can get through to the next round. They get a yellow card in Bunkle. Simon, Maddie Simon scores. Let's go. They score. Brosk, Miller, yellow card. Mm, it's half time. Chun comes on for Bonzo. McGinn gets injured. And O'Neill. O'Neill scores. Get in. And we're through. We win. We win 2 1. Get in. Just like last week's game against Melbourne City. <laughs> oh, yes. A good win there, though. Oh, we're through. We're through. Does that mean we go to the final? Or does that mean we have to... I know we've got to miss out on um, a few players not playing. But, um... Nine days. Like, he'll be back before the next game. Oh, no, it's here. Is that the final? Oh, no, it's the semis. It's the semis. I thought... I just thought we were not playing this match, but another game. Here we go. Three, two, one. Now, and we go into this match with a decent team, looking like Sooks playing his debut here. Cisse yellow card. O'Neill scores. O'Neill scores. Oh, can we go back to back to back? Tommy Hall scores, yes. No, McGree. Do they score again or do we score again or does it stay? And it, it, it does stay. We are through to the grand final. We are through to the grand final in the first season. Damn. We're through. So that means the next episode. 
Next episode, people. We're in the grand final. And we'll be playing the Wanderers. We'll be playing the Western Sydney Wanderers in the grand final. I really hope we can win that. I know you're not happy, McBarger. Next season, we will be changing the formation as well. We will be doing... We'll hopefully be doing a three-season special on this. And we get the, the Manager of the Month award. A goalkeeper. We have a goalkeeper too. So we could be going back... Or oh, next episode, we have a big game against the Wanderers in the grand final. I'm so pumped. Anyway, guys, hopefully you enjoyed. Next episode, we will be playing the grand final against the Western Sydney Wanderers in the first season of our A-League Mariners, Central Coast Mariners, Road to Glory, Youth Squad Legends Rebuild. And I'll see you in the next one for the biggest game of season one. We will be trying, we will be doing a few seasons of this. Like a lot of seasons of this. So we can keep just winning, winning every season. That'd be so fun. And just hopefully building a great side, bringing over some great regens. Anyway, see ya. Peace.